Hello and welcome to another video. This is for his Retro 81 and this is the Great Hall. Um, now, I will openly confess. Ah! Oh god. Well, I've still got plenty of armour. Um, that's what happens when you're trying to set your stopwatch off at the same time you're trying to play the game. Um, I thought I was in a calm spot. Obviously not. Uh, never mind. I'm sure we'll be able to come back from that alright. Um, let's get rid of them now. Or not. Gosh, that's a really helpful spot for a glitch in the middle of a hop across a jump. Well, I definitely see a hall, but I'm not sure what's so great about it. <laughs> uh, uh, hang on a minute. No, okay. Worth a try. Ah! Oh, I see a yellow key. Can we get it? Well, I think we can. Yes, sweet. That's the yellow key got. What's this do? Oh, nice. Oh, okay. That would have brought that down. But you can get that without pushing that switch, which is interesting. Uh, don't know how that would prove mega useful, but it might. I mean, there's not much point doing it instead of doing the switch, to be honest. Um, what's in this door before we go? Oh, hello. I don't see a lot of golems on this stage, that's for sure. Or this, this episode, even. Making out for time. Oh, we're doing pretty well. Good, good, good. It's the first night we've seen in a while as well, actually. Hello. So that pops a switch. Where's the switch pop? Yeah, that's what. Woo! Sweet. I do find those guys kind of oof, slip into the background quite easily on, on these. I mean, there's a lot of brown in Heretic, so having a predominantly brown enemy perhaps isn't a... Well, maybe it was intentional. I mean, they're very easy to see in an area like this. But not so much when they're out like this. Oh! There's some stuff we've alerted over here. Let's try and deal with it without getting shot in the face too much. After my shower, showering myself with glory at the start of the episode, we're, we're hurting a little bit more than I'd like to be on various things. He's stuck up there, seemingly. Which is good for me, not so good for him. Is that a permanent? That's a permanent switch. Um, so, I mean, we're, we're, not, we're not very close to the end end of the game yet in any way, shape or form, but we are closing in on the end of this spe specific bit of the game, of, of uh, Hell's Moor. I think we've got one more level after this one, and that level will be the boss fight. Ugh. Get out of my way! 
your pain. Um. Over there, over there. Can we ride this up? Yes, we can. Oh, sweet. Oh, and that brings us in here. Hop across here. We'll shoot these guys in the book. Oh, there's quite a lot of them. Oh, stop that. Grief, that's a lot of wizards. It's that weird kind of area there where, I, honestly, I probably should, probably could have dealt with that a bit quicker by dropping some uh, special weapons or something. But I always have this thing in this game where it's like, if there's a if there's a straightforward way of doing something, I prefer to do it the straightforward way and not faff around fiddling about with my inventory and such like. Which I don't know, it possibly makes these videos a bit less exciting to look at, but it's kind of like... I'm playing this on keys, complete keys, and complete keys does have some trauma to it, just in that you're keeps giving me these ball bearings but I haven't got the ball bearing weapon but yeah it's, it's quite it's not easy to quickly flick around in your inventory trying to find special weapons and really the only ones that I find completely useful are the quartz flasks and the times of power I'll just check I'm not about to do what I did at the start of the mission oh good grief there's thousands of them Thousands! They're all over the place! Oh, that's a bit cheeky. I don't trust there only being one of them in there, or two even. Extra at least. Oh man, I'm low on ammo again. Really wants to hurt you for your um, ethereal crossbow bolts. This map set episode, whatever. So the um. Blue key door was down here, wasn't it? Right. Oh, and that just takes you up there, doesn't that? Thank you. Now we've got a few more imps in here for certain. Imps I can deal with. Although the uh, opening of the mission might suggest otherwise. Get up here. Have some of that. Oh, I saw, I saw you coming this time, mate. Have none of that. Okay. I think we'd be pushing it to um, do the boss uh, in the same episode. Really dang sure this is the boss. Okay, um, I hope you're all doing well. I'm gonna call it here because although this is a short video, I don't know how long the boss stage for Hell's More is because I think it's another one that's like uh, the boss stage for City of the Damned where it's actually quite a complicated level, even though it's technically a boss fight in inverted commas. Um, so I'll call it here for now. Thank you very much for watching. Uh, much love to all of you and uh, peace out.